quiet once more. Still good. <laughs> oh, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Good. Okay, let's get out of here right quick. That's what you want. Good cog, is that you? Can't afford to get spotted by that watcher either. Good cog, is that you? Tis the builder's silence. All right, now phase two, let's hope they do get stuck on the way back up. So there they are, looks like they're stuck, this is what we want. Now we want the engine, what we're hoping will happen is that the engine will get through and then Cavador will stay stuck for a while. Well, the engine got through and Cavador didn't get stuck at all. I give thanks for my arms with them I make the world this rich. What I don't want is for the engine to go around. I want him to find a straight way through. Because then Cavador will try to come straight. That's what will separate them. I am the child of Paris and his winning servant. I am clear of form and pure of spirit. I will inherit the earth. So once you get to this point where they are stuck, you can just do the quick save, quick load dance until they do what you want them to do. The longer it takes, the better, because at least theoretically that's how long Cavador will be stuck to. Can't have Cavador go straight around like that. What may end up working a bit better is if I can get if I can land a quick save once the engine is out before Cavador tries to go around. All the way down to a fourth level save.
Perfect. Yes. He's clear. Cavador is stuck. That's what we needed. Now we can just abuse quick save, quick load again to hopefully keep Cavador from finding his way around. Every time Cavador deflects back down, I think I'll do another quick save. Oops. That was a bad one. Why aren't they sticking? They're just going straight around. Why? 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 There must be some reason. I'm angry. I really thought I had it when he popped straight through and Cavador was still on the other side. This will work, I know it. I just need to get a little luckier than I have been. I think what I need to do is use that create a slightly better hook. I need to... I need Cavador to stay stuck long enough for me to make that happen. Bomb thyself! Not happening. Not yet, anyway. This is killing me. He should stick just like the engine did. right through my crates like they're nothing. Well that won't do either. I hate this. How can 
they just go around like that? Okay, fine, we'll back up. Here's my new, new plan. Well, no, damn it, that should work. That really should work. Shouldn't just go around it like that. Not if the guy went through. Uh, they are, they are. So. A child in flesh is both First, let's make sure they get around. I discovered the unreliability of hiding in this corner. Once they get around, I'm gonna wait and see if they get stuck or not. Turns out I probably could have wise to scurry elsewhere. Probably could have just gotten Cavador's key here. Oh well. Okay, they're getting around, no problem. So, let's make a third save here now. Let's hope that they get stuck. Sprint out of here. Sprint, sprint, sprint. I really wanted to stay ahead of that watcher. What noise there? That soft didn't happen. So they've gotten around. That's good. For the builder's sake, what was that? Alright, they're gonna get stuck. It's that shadow move. Looks like it. Well that's just ridiculous. Tweaking this setup doesn't work, then I'll probably have to just start over. This is a long enough stick. I can't figure out why Cavador doesn't stick the same way once the engine finally gets through. 
and he doesn't. He's just going straight around. How does that work? I have not determined. No danger. There's no reason for this not to work. Because if he goes around, Cavador will just go around. But if he goes straight through, then Cavador should go straight through too. And be stuck for a while. I'm starting to get frustrated, people, and I do apologize for that. But there is no reason this shouldn't work. I think I saved with Garrett stuck inside the wall and didn't even notice. <sighs> what dragon Okay, good. Garrett can move. Really need you to find your way straight through again.
See, if Cavador would stick half as long as the engine, we'd be good. I practiced this so many times, and every time, Cavador did the exact same thing the engine did. I don't know why he's suddenly able to get through so much faster. I've got an idea, though. This run doesn't work. <laughs> Same thing I was trying to do the first time. I don't need the box of his left foot to deflect them around him anymore. Maybe, while the engine is still stuck, I can move that box over to the right to deflect them the other direction. So that they all try to go straight through instead of around. Oh, See what I mean? So, if the engine's stuck, let's hope he stays that way. Who's there? It. Who goes there? Is thy head? Nope, nope. He's gonna get right through now, of course. What noise that softly calls? Stop! Okay, I can't stack the crates or they'll hear it. Cavador's gonna get out. Just by going right around, no problem. <clears throat> That's not what's supposed to happen. What noise then? That softly call. Halt, weed! <laughs> oh gosh. I have to be careful because I can't cross into that forward light anymore. Shadow, now I just don't have time. How did I get stuck again? I swear. Right to do much box movement. Oh. Oh. Too much, too much, too much. One dragonfly fits some out. Stop! Take thou no further. I wonder if that might work. Just picking up the left box. What noise then? It softly calls. Uh, was just a moss in my eyes. So now all clear. <laughs> Oh, Cavador still pops oh, right around. Now. Oh, I thought that was gonna work for a second. I don't know why. What dragonfly 
Fits are out. Useless optimism, maybe. Quiet once more. Stop! How does Cavador just pop right through? This is killing me, folks! Why does the engine get through so much faster every time I try to drop down there and mess with things? Maybe I'm picking up the wrong box. Let's try this one. Who's there? Who goes there? No, that just led everybody straight through. Yeah, like, I, as I thought, that's that's the side I need to bolster. This is killing me. How does he? Every time I try to go down, he immediately gets through. But he stays stuck if I camp upstairs. Was a boiler, and it needs service to know. Cavador just comes through. Nothing's wrong. Uh, see if he goes around, then we're screwed because Cavador will just follow him around. Like that. That does not work for me. I'll tell you what. No, it's fed there. Oh, stuck in the wall on that one. Let's just. Did that shadow move? Detach. Quiet now. Oh, quiet. Quiet once more. I need Cavador to go try and go straight through the same way the first guy did. That's what I need. I don't know why he isn't doing it. I don't know how to force him to. If there's even a way to force him to. The problem, of course, is that if he goes around, then the caboose goes around, so there's no separation. So even though that might be enough, enough separation between the e Cavador and the engine, I need Cavador to go straight, so he's also separated from his caboose. Oh, that wasn't enough separation from the engine anyway. know that this will work. Let me see. 
Not enough, not enough. Who's there? Who Go there. He always makes it around as soon as he starts running. Someone plays at mischief! Ah. See, that's still in range of the mech and everybody else. I'm starting to think that what I need is for Cavador to get far enough on an attempt to go straight before he starts running. So when he starts running, that if he's angled out at all, that seems to propel him right around the back. I don't understand why this isn't working. This is exactly what worked on my practice run. It's killing me, folks. Killing me. It's making me very angry, I'm not gonna lie. You ever get that feeling that your game is just screwing with you? Like it knows what you're trying to do and is laughing in your face? You my nerves. I know it never actually happens. I know the game is not sentient. It has no emotions. It's not capable of hate or spite. But, man oh man, I am getting pissed off right now. I wonder if I have time to try and redirect Cavador. See, you get him in the shadows, and everybody still hears it.
every time I think it's gonna work, Cavador just suddenly squirts through. Oh, too soon. Oh, 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 Not enough. Need him to stick longer. It was a boiler. Everybody just came through. You know, I built up a little separation, but it'll be gone by the time they get up here. Because the game is just sending them right around. It has never done that before in any of my runs. spotted me. I wondered why he was running. This will work. I know this will work. Good enough. Rats would be wise to scurry elsewhere. Intruder! Bring my name! do a better job forcing the mech over to the right to clog up their angles a little bit better, but I think what needs to happen, I think I need to stick the mech farther out, so let's start over. I don't think there's anything else for it. Okay. They can seek out evil and keep me from harm's way. I give thanks to Paris for his responsible indications I have not determined. So what was the problem with that outing? They were too... Well, there's no need for that. I think we can use this one. Except I definitely can't have that. 
Can't get spotted by the watchers. I think the lead box is the real problem. I think that it's positioned in such a way that it's encouraging them to go around. So, I'm gonna have to let him out, which is dangerous. Okay, we got spotted by the watchers again. Always be careful of that. So I think we need this farther out, but still in a position to hook him. Let's try that. Let's see if that holds him or not. I think at this point I had already read the papyrus, hadn't I? Ah, knowing oh. where Cavador is, that's half the battle. No, I hadn't. Okay. Let's see if that holds him. I think what we want to do is have the box as far out as possible while still being in a position to hold it. So. That box to deflect them around him on the way down. This third one. You might have noticed how when he can see them when they're all on their way up. And, uh, he kind of starts to shift and bounce back and forth. Oh, the far one has spotted me. That third one is in an effort to control that. Well, here's hoping things go a little better this time. up out of sight three. Ooh, I don't know how well stuck the mech is. That bounce he's doing has me kind of nervous that he might be able to escape, but... We shall see, we shall see. I just really desperately didn't want to start over. That's why I got so frustrated. But... Sometimes you just life. have to realize it's not working and try and figure out why. Dark. Karis, be my great and ever shining light. No amount of messing with the back two boxes was keeping them st was keeping Cavador stuck. So I figure the lead box must have been too close to the wall, which was allowing them to deflect around 
instead of hugging the corner and going straight like the patrol route suggests they're supposed to. What I want is for him to march straight into the mech, because it can take forever, but it should eventually let one of them through at a time. And then the second one should get stuck, and he should be stuck a long time. Anyway, if this goes on too long, I might just start the mission over and scrap this recording altogether, but... I don't want to. And like I said, this is the single biggest challenge in Ghosting Thief 2. Getting Cavador without setting off any hunt alerts. Once we accomplish this, the rest of the game is easy. I mean, the rest of this level is easy. Once we get to the next mission, casing the joint, one of the easiest in any of the three games, period, bar none. Masks is also a pretty easy mission. And, surprisingly enough, Sabotage at Soul Forge isn't bad either. Because we don't have to go after all the equipment. Not in Ghost slash Supreme Ghost, we don't. And if you're not going after all the gear, Soul Forge isn't that bad. But, I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm talking about what happens after we kidnap Cavador, which is far and away the hardest moment in any of these games. And we still have to pull it off. Just waiting on Cavador. How long has it been since I read that papyrus? I read it at about the 19 minute. Yeah, he must be stuck somewhere. So let's quick save, quick load, try and free him. By the way, if you're wondering about Site 3 itself, there's nothing, there's no loot in Site 3 at all. There's a flash mine and a gas mine down at the bottom of the pit. Which, the gas mine in particular is very valuable gear, but there's no need for it. Of course, if the ghost rules didn't forbid it, one well-placed gas arrow could knock out Cavador's entourage, and then we could just run up and blackjack him. But we can't do that. We're ghosts, damn it. At this point, I have read the papyrus, right? Yes. I, I lose track of these things sometimes. Sticking point must be near the very beginning. 